Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to my channel, my dear friends. My name is Avilash and I'm a trader next door. In this video, I'll be analyzing the chart of Core USD. So, if you're watching my videos for the first time, you can subscribe to my channel for regular market analysis. So, let's get started. My dear friends, the market is open, and after the market opening, we can see that gold made a high of almost 1844 and right now showing some correction and standing at 1838 1839 level. And most importantly, after the market opening, we could see DXY recovering and DXY is also standing at 104.06. My dear friend, if you are looking for detailed analysis, please watch the video that I uploaded on Saturday because I do not want to repeat the same stuff and bore you again. So the overall levels that we discussed on Saturday are still the same. If you look at the chart of DXY, then yes, DXY uh, is trying to recover. So if the recovery is on then obviously the uptrend will continue on dxy in case during the day especially during the european session or us session dxy starts falling or shows some correction then remember the levels yes the levels are 103.6 to the first support and 103.38 this is the second support on dxy and if the volatility of the market remains like this then yes these levels are capable enough Okay, and should provide the required support to DXY. Let's wait and watch. And in case of a crazy upside, keep in mind 105 to 105.50. This is the resistance on the chart of DXY. FOMC is coming up after a few days. That's why I'm talking about the big resistance here. Because I, as I've already told you guys, that I may not be able to upload videos because I'll be leaving. I'll be leaving uh, to my native place. Uh, after a couple of hours <laughs> and i won't be available for three to four days so the bond chart the bond chart played a big role on friday if you're a lover of gold if your main focus is on gold or if you only focus on gold then yes u.s government bonds is also a very important chart for you because if the fall on bond continues then obviously you will see good upside on the chart of gold doesn't matter what uh, what goes on with dxy but yes you will see good amount of upside so this is the next support for bond 3.78 3 percent so if bond takes support and bounces listen to me carefully overall if you look at the chart of bond here you can clearly see bond is an uptrend bond chart is an uptrend the uh, the reason it reversed was there was a resistance here the market failed to cross the resistance i clearly mentioned in my private community in my whatsapp group that uh, why it reversed so keep in mind this was the reason why it reversed and we saw uh, an upside on the chart of gold so right now it is going for some correction if it takes support around this level and bounces again we will see further correction on the chart of gold again and if the fall continues okay listen to me carefully if the fall continues then yes we will see upside on the chart of gold and we have derived this level with the help of fibonacci because this is a trending market okay so um, if you love for to trade on gold if your focus is on gold only okay then yes bond chart also deserves your attention so if it bounces you will see correction on or selling on gold again if it starts falling then yes the upside on gold will continue clear and the levels that we have discussed on saturday are still the same again i'll say my dear friends that the major levels or the strong levels on the chart of gold are far away the strong resistance around um, so 1898 to 1903 is far away then we have a very strong support around 1792 1785 that level is that level is also far away and right now gold is stuck in this range here so again i'll repeat if you see gold coming down gold falling during the day okay observe the volatility of the market first because volatility will play a big big role if the volatility of the market is low then you can definitely expect the market to bounce from the previous support or the previous not previous support the previous low of 1819 to 1820 this low made by the market on 
Friday. So if the volatility on the market remains low, then you'll see market bouncing from this level. Why? Because see, for a proper breakout or breakdown, we need volume, we need volatility. If there is not much volatility in the market, then obviously market will not have the strength to go for a breakdown and market will bounce from that particular level. And you can expect a bounce of 40, 50 pips. If there is volatility, obviously you should avoid taking any buy position at support. So look at the size of the candles in the one hour chart or 15 minutes time frame. Okay, you will get the answer. And in case market continues the upside, continues the upside, then yes, you can look for a buy position, but it will be a risky buy position. Okay, if market breaks 1844 level, okay, if market breaks 1844 level, you can look for a risky buy position. If you have the experience, if you know proper risk management, then you can go for it. But if you're a beginner, new trader, you should uh, avoid taking buy position above 1844 level. And simply, you can look for sell opportunity around 1853 around 1853 it can be 1852 it can be 1854 as well around 1853 you can look for some selling opportunity if market hits 1853 level observe the market first on lower time frame not if for us this look <laughs> observe the market first if you see the market is um, struggling if you see market is showing price rejection from above if you see market forming a shooting sub pattern you will get the confirmation that okay market is facing the resistance and you can look for a sell position you can expect a profit of 40 50 pips and already i have discussed in my um, previous video that the uh, better resistances or in case during the us session market show, uh, shows good amount of volatility and upside then we have uh, 1870, 1873, 1870, 1873 also standing as the resistance zone in the market. Okay, so there are multiple, as the market was in downtrend for the last couple of days and weeks, as the, um, so there are multiple resistances. Okay, so let's wait and watch. Please be careful and follow proper risk management. If you're looking for signals, then please watch the next part of the video where I'll be talking about chart prime. So my dear friends, I may not be available for the next um, three, four days, so trade responsibly, do not gamble with your hard and money. Before we proceed further, I would like to mention about Chart Prime, who has sponsored the today's video. Those who want to generate their own buy and sell signals, please watch the video carefully because Chart Prime is one of the best custom indicator service in the trading world right now. With the tools available in Chart Prime, you can not only generate buy and sell signals, you can also use these tools in your analysis for additional confirmation. They also have a trading community on Discord where they post regular trading ideas. Trust me guys, I have been using Chart Prime for a couple of months and their service is really, really awesome. If you really want to know how these indicators work, you can just go to their website chartprime.com and just go to the tutorial section. You will see the functioning of these indicators. Okay, my dear friends, as we are traders, we believe in probability. So there's, I won't say that this, these indicators are 100% accurate, but with proper risk management, you can definitely make some money. Let me show you. This is the 15 minute chart of gold. You can see the signals generated by chart prime. Okay, see possible reversal down. See, it means that we need to take a sell position here. Possible reversal up means we need to go for a buy position. Possible reversal down means we need to go for a sell position. If not trend reversal, at least you can expect 40, 50 pips on daily basis with the help of the software. But yes, the tool also generates false signal sometimes because 100% accuracy is not possible as we all know but yes the accuracy is certainly very very good along with the buy and sell signals you can also see that they have an oscillator where they also provide the overbought oversold divergences and many other things just watch the tutorial you will know all the things you can just go with the one month subscription and just try the product yourself i'm very much sure that you will love the product and my dear friends if you use the link in the description below you'll also get 30 percent discount you may also scan the qr code available on the screen for faster registration check them out